What's going on guys? Today I wanted to hop on here and talk about something that I get asked about pretty often. A lot of people will ask me, why do your athletes pull sumo as opposed to using a conventional deadlift or even uh, using a trap bar? This is a great question. You'll see people all over social media saying that sumo is cheating, your deadlift numbers really don't count if you're pulling sumo. But that debate really doesn't matter when it comes to developing athleticism. The reason that the majority of my athletes pull sumo as opposed to a different variation is because the majority of my athletes play baseball and have the goal of improving their throwing velocity or exit velocity. And what I've found through the past four years of training athletes is that a major key in developing elite level velocity and power at the plate is improving your lateral ground force. Think about it. Baseball is a game that is played in wide stances. Hitting is done in a wide stance, throwing is done in a wide stance, even base running, you're starting in a wide stance. If you, don't, if you want to have elite level of athleticism on the baseball field, throw 90 miles an hour or more, have more home runs, you have to produce high amounts of force in those wide stances. This is also known as lateral ground force. This is why we pull sumo, to increase a maximum amount of force production and increase the rate of force development in these stances that you're going to be using on the field. So if you're not already uh, pulling sumo or training in wide stances, start adding them into your program. This could be the missing key of improving your throwing velocity or power at the plate.